This is an iPhone 6. This is Cydia. And this is Cydia running on an iPhone 6. As you can see from here, it's running perfectly fine on an iPhone 6. And I can go ahead in here, do whatever I want to do. And as you can see, things are working. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to do the same. But keep in mind, it's a tedious process. So be sure to pay attention. So what is up guys, Joe Snow right here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak the iPhone 6 running 10.0 to 10.2. And we're going to use Yalu, but we're not going to use the official Yalu. We're going to use a uh, version that I created, a modified version, because I wanted to make it a little bit different. So uh, I'm going to show you the official Yalu project has been updated to support the iPhone 6, but unfortunately the IPA that is available isn't updated and as you can see it still support only iPhone 6s and SE which means we need to create our own. In order to create your own you need to download the Xcode project, open Xcode, build it and play with code signing and so on. But I'm going to save you from that and I created already a Yalu fork, a Yalu IPA that is compatible with the iPhone 6. It's using the latest patches, uh, look at the scope made and I created my own um, look for it. So we're going to, to see. In order to deploy it, you need CDI Impactor, open it and drag the application in here and simply sign in with your Apple ID and password. Alrighty, you click OK and it will start deploying the application like this and you should have it on your screen. I already used it as you probably see from the beginning of the video, but I'm going to show you how to deploy it. And keep in mind, this is not the original Yalu, this is my own modified version. Uh, if you want to use the original, go ahead. But the um, code is not modified, at least not too much. I only made a new module that detects the operating system version, what iOS version you're running. So let's see on the device. Alright, so back on the device, as you can see, it has the Yalu icon, but I renamed it from Yalu 102 to simply Yalu. And if you open it, it looks like this. In my case, it says it's already jailbroken. So uh, please keep in mind, this is not the official Yalu. As I said uh, here on the top, it says this is just Snow's FC365 fork. Fork means a modified open source tool. And uh, it says this is not the original Yalu one, uh, 102 or 10.2. So here on the bottom, I added a new feature. When you see you are rocking and it says the version you're on. And in my case, I'm running 10.1.1, but this works on 10.1, 10.1.1, 10.0.2, 10.2 and so on. It doesn't work on 10.2, uh, sorry, on 10.2.1, so do not try it there. Also, it's not supporting the iPhone 5S and the iPod Touch for the moment, and 32-bit devices are not supported. Keep in mind, I am not the one who made the iPhone 6 patch, so it wasn't me the one who created the compatibility, it was Luca Tedesco, so I'm not trying to take credit for that. I just compiled it together because there aren't any compiled IPAs available and uh, I decided to put it up in a uh, in an IPA and you can download it right now. Of course, if you want to jailbreak, you will click here on jailbroken. It, it will say jailbreak now in your case and you click it and wait. It will simply restart your phone and will be jailbroken. I'm going to show you. In my case, I'm already jailbroken, so there shouldn't be any problem. You can see I am jailbroken, definitely. Uh, iPhone 6, iPhone 7.2, which is iPhone 6, Cydia 32.1.27, let me try to find something, I will try to find um, I file, but I'm not going to, uh, no, let me try the mobile terminal, M, M terminal, all right, this one in here, I'm going to try to install it for you to be able to see, it's working, and there we go, you can see it actually installed the uh, the file completely. It works, it's still a beta. Uh, the support for iPhone 6 was added by uh, Look at the Disco yesterday. So I assume it's not completely um, working properly, but it is actually doing the job. And you can see it says no at mobile terminal and you name uh, dash A. And as you can see, it's working with no problem. So, um, yeah, you should be good to go now. 
As I said, you can jailbreak now only the iPhone 6, 6s and SE. Unfortunately, there is no iPhone 5s support for the moment, but there will be probably and most likely. So I'm gonna keep you informed. You can download my fork from GitHub and you can also download the project if you wanna fiddle with it. And yeah, take this as my contribution to this, uh, this part of jailbreak. So uh, yeah, this is basically it. Do not forget, subscribe to stay updated. Tell me in the comment section down below what you think about the UI, the graphical user interface, about the application, and um, how, if, how what do you think about Yalu in general? So yeah, peace out.